Hey, what is up, guys? My name is Talha, and you are watching Gadgets Sphere. So this is the Poco F4, and I have been using it since a really long time. And one thing I found out for sure that is screen guards, which are of very cheap quality, like this one was fifty rupees. They break very, very easily. You guys can see a lot of things happen. I also have a major crack here as well. You guys can see that as well. So yeah, in today's video, I'm going to show you one of the best screen guards you can buy for this smartphone, and I'm also going to show you how to apply it. So I just ordered it from Flipkart. This is the package. Let's unbox it normally. Let's just tear it up and open the package. So this is the screen guard I ordered from Flipkart. Now this is of a very nice actually brand. It's called Faddy Essentials. Now this video is not sponsored by any other thing, so don't worry about that. But this is actually a really good screen guard. It has you know all the instructions you need to basically just apply it so i'm just gonna unbox it and then i'm gonna show you what are the contents in the box and how to actually apply this screen guard to your poco f4 and get rid of these cheap quality ones which break super easily so let's get started so here we have the screen guard we have the special thank you for you know buying this fatty essential screen guard it says 100 percent quality check for satisfaction let's just keep it aside and once we open it we have the screen guard for the poco f4 and then we have a lot of other things we have stickers to actually clean the dust from your you know smartphone then we have the main part that is the screen guard so this is the screen guard i bought now this is of a super high quality material you guys can see let's just see how to apply this in your poco f4 so you shouldn't do it in a you know bed like this but like i am gadget sphere i can do anything so it also comes with a nice fiber microfiber cloth which will be very helpful for cleaning and then we have the wipes the wet wipe and the dry wipe so if we keep all of the all of the things aside and let's just open this screen guard oh my god look at that whoa this is the screen guard which is broken so let's just keep it aside i'm going to throw it in a second so now after you have taken it aside what you need to do is you need to first i think you should first always clean it with a microfiber cloth because this will prevent any scratches or any problems that will happen to your smartphone so just clean it very very nicely so i'm just cleaning it and now once everything is clean if you want what you should do is you should open this wet wipe and then just tear it out and just tear it out and remove this you need to use the wet wipe and just wipe it very gently make sure nothing you know you don't have to apply a lot of pressure what many people do is they apply a lot of pressure and they make this big mistake because for these kind of stuff you don't need a lot of pressure you just need simple gentle cleaning so you can apply the wet wipe every corner very very nicely no need to hurry because otherwise your smartphone will not be super well working so just there you go after you have wiped from the wet wipe you need to take the dry wipe and this is actually very important because all the dust particles are now on the screen of your smartphone so after you use the dry wipe you will be free from every dust particle that can exist so just normally wipe it again super gentle wiping we don't need to you know show our strength here in the screen so just super gentle wiping no problems here so after we have done all the wiping what we need to do is we need to take the screen guard let me just keep it aside keep your phone super steady let me just zoom in a bit so you can see very nicely super steady keep your phone you should actually close the fan but i am just doing it my way no problems now this is the screen guard right so you need to actually tear it from here from the top and then you need to apply it so yeah there you go and you need to actually align your smartphone in such a way that it applies super perfectly so there you go and now just align it super easily try to align the you know the front camera with this if you will be able to do that successfully then everything will be fine so i think it's almost perfect and then gently keep it and then just press press as hard as you can and there you go there you go it's successfully applied you guys can see i have actually applied from the front camera very easily and there you go it is perfectly done no problems everything is working perfectly fine and yeah it was applied in one attempt now you guys can see i got zero bubbles here but you know there are ways where you can actually do this even better while you know keeping your smartphone on the table and doing other things so but right now i got zero bubbles that is very nice 
and one thing which i really like about the screen guard is the smoothness now this is actually very very smooth absolutely super smooth so that is what i love a lot about this screen guard so if you really want to buy a screen guard you should buy from this brand the fade e screen guards they make good quality screen guards so you can buy from them and i've also bought a cover which is from cedo this was a very cheap cover like 150 rupees okay it shows 600 but it's not actually that expensive so i got it for like around 150 160 rupees and this is the cover you can just simply apply it and there you go your poke f4 is super protected now so now i will make a lot of videos about the custom rooms for this poke f4 that's pretty much it for today's video i just wanted to show you the best cover and case you can buy for this smartphone so that's it hope you like it i'll see you in the next one peace out